You're listening to TUSD Pillars, part of the 150-year celebration of Tucson Unified School District. Dozens of chess trophies line the upper shelves in the library at Sam Hughes Elementary School. Jim Talmadge taught at Sam Hughes for 35 years. He learned to play chess from one of his students in 1974. Jim still teaches chess there every week to every class. Talmadge Hall was dedicated to him in 2007. My name's Jim Talmadge. Uh, when I first started teaching, I looked like Clark Kent, and about four years later, I looked like uh, the leader of some motorcycle gang. And part of that was I used to always wear three-piece suits, so they didn't know what to do with me. I looked like a motorcycle guy in a three-piece suit. So I started when I was 21. So I was only like 10 years older and some nine in some cases older than some of the kids in my class. And I look at them, I, I, I see their body, and I know they're like 45 years old, but when I look at them, I see their, their head as an 11 and 12 year old when they were in my classroom. Well, it's been my, the, the biggest part of my life for almost 50 years, so it means fun and excitement I remember when I get in my car to drive to school today, it was never a, one of those things where, oh God, I mean, if you didn't feel good or something like that. But you knew coming to school that there was gonna be something different happening every day. That's what I loved about teaching because no, no two days were the same. You know, and then our chess program over the years, we've had that. I've been the chess coach here since 1974. And we've been very successful. And I actually got the chance when I, I learned to play chess from one of my students in 1974 because a kid came in from another school that had a chess program and he said, Mr. Talmadge, can we have a chess club? I said, yeah, Wayne. He says, well, uh, can you be the coach? And he was about four feet tall. And I said, Wayne, uh, yeah, I'll be the coach, but there's one thing wrong. He said, what's that, Mr. Talmadge? I said, well, Wayne, I don't know how to play. And he looked up at me like this. He says, don't worry, I'll teach you. And that's the way it started. You know, we've gone, it's a local, the, the state, we played in national tournaments and, and won trophies in the, at a national level. And they always talk about playing their grandma or their grandpa or something like that. And just, we can just see they're, they're happy, you know. Talmadge Hall, it's a great place. I have a ball at Talmadge Hall. They thought they were fooling me, but I, I knew that there was something wrong. So I, I, I got this thing, you are invited to this or that, whatever, whatever the presentation was, and they, you know, oh, and it's gonna be a wonderful presentation. I said, what are they presenting and everything? So, well, I came and sure enough, the principal at the time did, you know, was doing this talk and she had this easel. And on this easel, she had a, a, a picture of me under a drape from about 1971. I don't know if you ever saw that picture of me. It's in the... Uh, it's in the teacher's lounge. Well, at that particular time, I had uh, shoulder length hair. I had a Fu Man shoe that came down to here. I had mutton chops that grew into that. And uh, the picture that they have is, uh, I had a, a, a leather visor on and some photo gray glasses. And that's what she, and I, oh, this, is, this is gonna be dedicated to Mr. Talmadge. And then she pulls this drape and it's just, picture from like 1971. I was wonderful. It's absolutely wonderful. You know, it's just, I, I wouldn't trade it for anything. I mean, just, I often walk around and just, uh, just look and you look in certain areas and you remember certain things from certain years and some things weren't there. They're there now, like this is this and Talmadge Hall. And I remember what it was before that and what the old library used to look like. And where the bike racks used to be. One of my favorite things is to, is to, to come on the playground and uh, when the kids are outside playing and yelling and running around, just close my eyes. The sounds I hear coming from the squealing and the yelling and the stuff, just it's like music to my ears, really good music in my ears. And then I, and then I, then I catch myself shaking my head like that, you know. And now you know why you're here where you're supposed to be. This is where you're supposed to be. Just to hear the fun and the excitement and the, and then if you open your eyes up, they're hugging each other and you know, yeah, it's the place you gotta be. You know how they create these all-star teams and stuff and they play all-star games and stuff like that? That's what I feel like when I come to Sam Hughes, that I'm on, 
I'm, I'm just a part of this, this, this all-star team. Very proud to have been a part of it, let's put it that way. Yeah.